if I'm looking for a producer, um, for me, I'm always looking for somebody that does something I don't do. And, and I, I pr I've been for a decade now producing every kind of genre artist from, from rock to dance to pop to hip hop. So for me, I want somebody who's like, they have a sound or a thing that they do that I know, f I know for certain, no matter how much time I spent, I couldn't capture it or match it. We used Phoenix producer uh, in Paris, Philippe Sidar. Um, he was the first guy we reached out to. And we did one of the biggest songs on the album, uh, Burning Bridges, we did with him. We did another one with Something's Gotta, called Something's Gotta Give. He's 50% of a group called Cassius. That's a French electro, um, I don't even know, organic electro French group. I don't know how you'd even describe them, but um, phenomenal. And then uh, another song we have called Can't Stop that doesn't sound like anything out there. And that was intentional too. We reached out to Jeff Basker who did Fun, the We Are Young and all those songs that they did. And, and <coughs> Kanye West's last album, Bon Iver. Um, and his sound is just so unique and distinctive. I knew on that song that he was the only guy that could figure that. I couldn't figure it out. I did four attempts at this song, four different times, four damn demos, couldn't finish it. Sent it to him and said, this song is either going off the album and I'm giving it to somebody else, uh, or, or you're gonna nail it, and he nailed it, so. My approach for working with another producer is on day one, or the, the first, the first pass that we take at the song is, is always me shutting up 100% letting them steer, 100%. I always like the first, the first stab we take at it, I don't want my influence on it at all because obviously I'm coming to you, clearly I, I'm not cracking the code on this. So I literally, I almost don't even want to be there to be honest. I want to go in, sing the song over an acoustic guitar, walk away, all right, do your thing. And then if they nail it on that first time, then everybody's happy. And then if not, if they don't get it on that first pass, then you, that's when usually when I put on the, like the producer hat and step in and I'm like, okay, here's what I love about what you, what you did and here's what has to change. And here's what we have to keep from the demo. And then, it, then that push and pull kicks in. But um, I'm always hoping that they get it on the first try because that's easy for them and it's easy for me. Everything that kills me makes me feel alive.